Is it inside? Inside where? His bedroom. Focus my stress on father alone. I beg you, relax. Eh? Everything will be fine. Please, have a seat. Please, madam. Calm down. My queen, the real doctor has arrived. He's attended to his royal majesty. Thank God. At least the devil did not prevent this. Mother. This is not the right time to apportion blame to the devil, okay? Father is ill, and this is not the first time. He'll be fine. He'll be okay. Just drink something. Now the doctor is here, he can just take care of you. Please, just drink something. Since you don't want to eat now, okay? Thank you. You'll make me worry too if you keep going this way. Everything will be fine. Oh no! Son of Okadike! Oh no! Son of Okadike! Oh no, son of Okadike! The mediator between man and the gods. I greet you, spiritual ambassador. The mouthpiece of the gods is the Monwi. <laughs> oh no, son of Okadike. My visit to your house is not a pleasant one. Does that forbid you from coming inside and eating cola not with me? Have I offended you or any other one? Who offended you? Far from it. I am concerned about the dream I had last night. The urgency of the dream will not allow me to laugh or eat with anyone. Till something is done. Tell me about the dream, isn't it? In my dream, I saw a hand removing the symbol where only is written. This is a bad one, isn't it? What do we do? Sacrifice! Oh no, sacrifice! What I saw. It's no good for this land. Whatever it is, it's not for the betterment of our new year. I won't be for this. I have uh, given him medications that will control his systolic and diastolic pressure. Okay. He's just going to rest a little while. He'll get better. Thank you, doctor. It's not as if he has not been having high blood pressure. But this particular one actually got me scared last night. I 
didn't even know you would make it here this morning. You will be better. You will be. Okay. Yeah. Anyway, may you live long. Do you know if Onu is here to see you, my king? Let him be, Solomon. Your queen mother. I greet you, Chase. I greet you too, no. What's wrong with him again this time, Doctor? Igwe, how are you? He won't be able to speak to you for now. But he will get better. Okay. He will be. However, uh, Manu, can I see you outside? Okay. Excuse me, Your Highness. <laughs> is in a vegetable state. The doctor advised that we should take him to a better hospital or better still send him abroad for proper medication. The dream is the same with the king's health. What do we do? How are we going to get all this money? Let us look for this money anywhere, anyhow. Who can't allow him to remain in that state? He's our king. Let's go in search of money. Then we have to tell our sons and daughters that can help us. The urgency of this whole thing is what worries me. Let us meet our brother, Bruno Okala, and explain everything on Grand Dream. I just want to know why. Why didn't you tell us, the family, that he needed to be taken somewhere else? You ran and you went and told your noble. Why didn't you tell us? You know he's been sick. And we don't even know who is responsible for this sickness. You are my father then. What kind of mistake is this? Eh? I'm sorry. I, 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 I understand that the, the, the king's problem is the community's problem. And I, I have to tell you no because he's second in command. I, I'm sorry. Enough. That does not even make sense to me. The king is my father. And also the, the, the husband to my mother. We are his first family for crying out loud. You are supposed to tell us. Your Majesty. What? Sorry for interruption. What? The king wants to see that person. Okay, Majesty. It's not as if you have no intention to But you should have told us that. My daughter is not happy. And that is not totally out of her mind. But she's only protected. I have no clear motives. My, my intentions were genuine. My life is still genuine. But I'm not here. Yeah. I heard your voice. Who are you 
sinta melhor muito com o Suna. You don't want to tell me? Edmond told the owner that you should be taken to a better hospital or even abroad for proper medicals. He didn't even tell mother or I, and I thought that was very inappropriate. It really made me angry. Hmm. But I'm fine now, Father. I'm fine. And then, Maya, you don't have to bother yourself. Hmm? I'll be fine soon. Just stay with your mother or children. Very soon I'll be alright. Okay? Okay, Father. That's my girl. <laughs> Thank you, Father. I don't know the person either, but I think it is nice. Because when you think of the distance from Amoji to the stream, when I see them coming back with gallons of water, I pity them because of the distance. Looking at this, it is not the government project. I think it is one of their sons or daughters who must have suffered fetching water from Guinness Street that decided to dig this borehole. At least it is helping our people. One or two of this in this community. Yes. Then our people will stop suffering going to Ungele Stream to fetch water. This is what we need. Let's go. Whoever that does this, the God will help. There's the water. When I asked you to send me to school, did you agree? Hmm? You are a school teacher from Okala family. But you chose to send your direct brothers to school. But where are they now? Answer me, where are they now? My son, we have not come to start counting who did this. And who did that? No! Oh no! Let me talk to them! Happiness belongs only to those who think for others. Are they open up? Now you, when my mother was sick, I came to you to beg you for money to buy her some drugs. What did you do? You kept turning me up and down. Come today, come tomorrow. Making promises. Turning me 360 degrees as if I was a ceiling fan. Bruno. Is it a lie? Bruno. Hangs are forgotten when gains follow. Why are you remembering the pains of yesterday? I am not happy over this. This is a family matter. No! Oh no! The reward of success is success. You think it is only those that went to school that will succeed? No! You lie! As a matter of fact, no one from Okala's family can challenge me financially. As a matter of fact, I can send the Igwe to the best hospitals in Europe, even to America. But I will not. Because he did not help a single person from my family. In fact, leave my house now. It does not come. To me. 
Huh? Let's try to handle this matter. I Properly. Oh no! I will not help! In fact, my heart is sickly. Yes! Let the Igwe sell all his plots of land. I will buy all of them and use some of them to build my big poultry farm and make more money. Yes! That's what I'll do. Leave now. Leave all of you. Leave! Leave now! He will come back tomorrow or next. Yeah. Mana, for the urgency of the matter, I will call him. Please mm -hmm. do. Thank you. You were Onyama, your husband, was my good friend. Mm -hmm. See how God does his things in his own way. Thank you once more. God bless you. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. My elders, oh no, do I bring more drinks for you? Uh, no, no, don't worry. We're okay. I'll take this with you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. He's keeping faith. What am I? Yes, he's doing a very good job on me. I can see. <laughs> Who are the people who came looking for me? Yes, Ono and some of the elders. Okay. They said the Igwe is not feeling very well. That his state of health is super bad. 
They're looking for money to care of him. How are you going to treat a bad condition when they still have people like me around here? Can say that again, my son? What are you as the one of only a kingdom? Go with the deal on me. They're looking for 30 million. Probably one B. Go with the deal on so I will go and see the Igwe okay. and solve his problem. Thank you, my son. Thank you again. <laughs> and I made a good say an apple specifically for her. So for me, serious. Mama, you'll love it. <laughs> Mama, thank you. You love that. It's so good. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody is gone! Hey! She away here, no need. Take over! Ah! Everybody is here now! Obinu Gwesh in Akume! Ono! I came to know if what I had on the phone is true. Obinu Gwesh in Akume! The king of Anui! Break my father. Greet the great men of Oni that have journeyed before you. Meet them well. Remember to speak for us in the presence of Chuku, the all knowing deity. Oh no. The king will be buried tomorrow night. Remember, it is an occasion where only the titled men are dead. You've no eating. Calm down, okay? Stop crying. You just try, try and eat so you have energy. I don't want you to break down, please. No, I don't want to eat it. I don't want to eat it. My father did not have like to hold money in this world, but he was a good man. I don't know why he had to just die and leave me. I the important thing is, he was a good man. I remember, I remember the day I told him I wanted to get married to you. Yes. It's okay, there's no problem. 
Don't worry, I'll get back to you. I have somebody in the palace with me. Yeah. Okay, thank you very much. Solomon. Young man, how are you? I'm fine, Your Highness. What do you say you do for a living? Uh, Your Highness, I'm into hospital equipment, though it's not that big. That's good. I like that. Thank you, Your Highness. I like that. I like to see young men like you who are very, very industrious doing something good for themselves. I want to give my child to a man who is a good man. Who can be rich tomorrow? If you struggle very well, God on your side, you can become rich. Not an already made rich man who is a bad man. But mind you, I'm not saying that wealth is bad. But I'm saying that I place more importance on someone's character. Character is the best thing. So you're welcome. Thank you, Highness. I promise you I will make you proud. I will never disappoint you. I will take good care of your daughter. That's a good one. Thank you, Highness. It's good to hear that. You're welcome, Nelson. Thank you, Highness. By the way, how is everything generally your side? Highness, your manager has not been busy. I miss him too. He promised me that all the the kings in the neighborhood will come for our wedding. I'm missing the Lord. Stop crying. Just eat your food, please. My princess, sorry to interrupt your meal. The queen mother wants to see you in her chamber. Okay. Stop crying. I take my leave. Stop crying. I think you are right, is it? What the gods revealed to you was our king's death. I came to understand. My worry now is who will succeed our king. Our late king had no male child. Tradition, our culture, still stand. We will continue. I am as worried as you are. Our late king died because he had no one to take care of. And to avert this, we need a witch king. I want you to appeal to our own kids. I want you to inform your colors to select who will succeed our king. I will be on my way. This one you are panting. Uh, I heard what happened, so I am going to the palace to see the queen and the oh no. Yeah. I hope your families are well. Uh, they are all fine, they are all fine. Yeah, Let right. me be rushing. Okay. Uh, mm. We'll see you later. Eh? Uh, uh, well, as a matter of fact, mm. the royal farewell is not a small money. How do we go about it? Can if I get me? That is a big problem. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.
Yes. I don't like it. For the fact that my uncle took ill, it got worse, and then he died. And nobody deemed it fit to tell me. I am not happy about it. And that is a complete letdown on my person. Okay, Bruno, don't be offended now. Don't be upset with I and mother. We were not aware. The doctor told us nothing about the situation. He went and told the owner who the truth and left us in the dark. We had no idea what was going on. He only told us father needed to rest. Oh, Jesse. I received a call that wasn't placed at last night. So I decided to come and see the real household. How did it happen? It is where I see it. Hi! It's still like a dream to me. Hi! Arrival of Chief Ikezebi, one of the one of only kingdoms. <laughs> My names are Ike Ezeb, aka Wana Yeze Wan of Umul. Some elders came to my house and told my mom about our king's health. So my mom called me and told me about it. I rushed down here to solve the problem, but to my greatest surprise, what I'm hearing is white. Shocking, confusing, and devastating. So please, what happened? So you are what I what I said. Hey, I'll be looking for you. <laughs> my queen, my queen. This is the person that built uh, the school at here. Um, the ball at Amoji and the hospital at the Obodibo. Our sons and daughters, he gave employment. This is ah, mainly even scholarships. I'm just seeing him for the first time. Hey, 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 hey. Come back here. Come back here. Look at you. Frank, I am totally disappointed in you. President, Pan Union. You are here, praising a man that came for condolence visit. Enumerating what and what he has done. He built tap water, he built a, 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 a borehole. Are these things you are enumerating more important than the death of Igwe? My brother, you are taking it personal. Keep quiet! Keep quiet! I am Bruno Chukujebu Okala from Okala dynasty, royal dynasty. And you are a bloody commoner. You don't speak when a royal blood speaks. That is our tradition. Do you know who you are speaking with? You are talking to Chief Ikezebe. One I hear the one of only kingdom. Oh, but will you hear not? Is this expired fool aware of talking to a billionaire? Who did you call expired fool? That's what you are, expired fool. You call me expired fool? Be careful, you're talking to a billionaire. You don't have any money. <laughs> Do you have money? No. I can swallow you. You don't have money. My money can swallow you. Anyway, I will not waste my time talking to you. Uh, where is my heart? Where is my heart? Please don't leave. Don't, don't, don't take it personal, please. Go, uh, just come back. We just came in and you're leaving now. I don't this know. expired fool. Just insulted me and you're telling me to come down. Who is he? Don't yeah. tell me. Who is he? He's my uncle Bruno. Don't take it first. He's like that with everybody. What is Bruno? And um, I what will is not Bruno? tolerate this kind of nonsense. What is Bruno? Remove this, this card here. Remove it and let me, let me get out of this place. Are you serious? 
So this is the carton you came with, and you are talking about money. <laughs> so this is the carton you came with. What are you calling carton? And you are talking about money. What carton are you talking about? <laughs> so this is the carton you came with. What are you referring as carton? When echo. <laughs> Remove this guy here now. You are not moving an inch. Oh yes, you heard me loud and clear. What? You are not moving an inch. Did I hear you say? You are not moving an inch. I am not moving an inch. Okay. I want to know how rich you are. Yeah. I will set this cat on a blaze and give you the money here and now. Mobile transfer. You are rich, right? You don't have anything. Okay. Oh, we go, we go. <laughs> you are a ritualist. Oh, we go, dizzy. Okay. You are not moving an inch. Remove this guy now. I want to see your power. Okay. You don't talk to a billionaire like that. <laughs> you are not moving an inch. I will set this cat on a blaze and give you the money here and now. Mobile transfer. Remove this car now, I said. Remove this car. I want to see I will pass this car now. I want to see your power. I will pass it. You say you are rich, right? Okay. I want to know how rich you are. You want to know how rich you are. You want to know what I'm doing. You are not moving an inch. Stop dramatizing. You are still here. You think it's because of this old way of you people money you make. Okay. You want to come and you think you can come and sign. Okay. Is it what you think? I don't blame you. Okay. When you are fired, you will remove it. I want to know what came out. Because I want it to be alright. He actually died of abnormal high blood pressure. Um, in simple terms, stroke. Just for the reference. He died of um, stroke or abdominal, whatever you call it. And um, who did you tell? I told the Prime Minister, you know, because he's the second in command. And um, I didn't fit into the house. He's only who the wife. He's only who a member of his immediate family, the Ochala family. Let me tell you, you killed my uncle. You are lying. You killed my uncle, didn't you? You are pretending. I will deal with you when I'm ready for you. Come on, get out. Get out. Get out. What oh, rubbish. Inform him of the, this problem, but we met his mother. Yes, yes, yes. Is it that? Now, immediately his mother called him. He rushed to meet the immediate person to know where he could help. That took him to the palace. So, forget. Forget from now. Forget from now. And the most nice plan. I heard that they were going well. Yes, it went well and was very peaceful. My brother, every one of us left the burial plane sorrowful. Well, about the next plan before the Ruyo farewell, I mean the last of all, we will have the next person to succeed the king. So the old Kalas family will give us the next person, just one person to succeed the king. Oh, 
Philanthropist of our time. Look at your palacious mansion. Look at the heaven you build on your head. Tell me, who deserves to be the king of Onui better than you? There is no. There is no. I have a feeling if you live with all this your philanthropy, with the old people and the lives you watched, and you die by adventure and go to heaven, God is going to send you back. Because if the leadership of Onui gets into the wrong hands, they will start suffering again. Onui Kingdom meets I'm just coming from the West Palace. I'm not happy with what I saw. The king is dead. I had sent to the United States. He was a good man. No one to succeed. You said you were the palace today and you saw something that made you not happy. What did you say? The palace is not befitting of the king. Now that the king is dead, what is the way forward? Your palace will be And whoever that will be will face a deity. A visit to Abumbi is a financial intervention. Yes, it is always very interesting. None of that is my business. All I know is that I will build a new palace for the next thing. A befitting palace. The elders and people of Onui have discussed and come to a conclusion that from time immemorial, starting from Ozo Izanyangu Mbala the first, to the last UJU Mora, no other family have ruled us. Okay. For this, I wish to announce that the Okalas should bring forward a candidate that will succeed UJU, the last Mpala. <laughs> Meanwhile, <laughs> let the people of Onui prepare for the last royal farewell greeting. Otwa! Oyanu! Oh, come on, man. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, give me. Oh, come on. Oh, give me. 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 Oh, no. What is Bruno? Yes, what is Bruno? Because I don't understand. Let me tell you what you don't know. Successful people are not lousy. They are always silent and smiling. So what is Bruno? If I may tell you about Bruno, he is the son of Onya Achonan, the younger brother to the Igwe that died before this current Ezimo was installed. Uh. 
I was not in the country when all this happened. I believe my mother should know about it. Mm. And after Onyachonam's burial in December that year, Bruno entered this town with lots of money. And it is said that Onyachonam, his father, was used for money ritual by Bruno. Is he married? Uh, yes. Would you, the wife and kids, live abroad? But I want you to know this, that Bruno has been behaving as if he wants to tear this kingdom apart. Hello. Forget about you. Empty vessel. That's the one of this. He's a philanthropist. He's a good man. A man. I want you to make vegetable soup for me. I don't want much pepper in it. Amanda, you will take care of it and the former assistant. You sent for me, mother. Sit down, my daughter. You can leave. Thank you. I don't understand why Nelson should go meet your uncles and ask them to proceed with your marriage plans. Which made me start asking questions. What no questions, mother? Questioning his sense of reasoning. Sorry, but common sense should tell him that he should not ask the questions he asked your uncles. Please tell him not to bring us out. I'm sorry about that, mother. I have no idea. It won't happen again. I hope so. For the betterment of our kingdom, I concur with your idea. But forces might fight against this young man who I hear. Forces like what, Honorable? If we make it a law, we will abide by it. Only you people will decide. Yes, that will be on the legal terms, not traditional setting. Apunpe will decide who will become our king. Apunpe is not human, but a deity that controls humans. I understand. But can't we do away with Apunpe? So that the goodness can come to us. There's two more than that person. Do you know what and what that was used to install it? You and I know that it's not the Bible and the oil that our forefathers went far to get. We are talking about deity here. Our own deed is to force them. Suffering of the rich is amongst the sweetest pleasure of the poor. There is a tussle for the mantle of leadership in this kingdom. And my family, the Okala family, will bring out someone who will become king. And I am the richest. So what do you make of it? We are not from this kingdom. We will achieve your aim. As long as you pay us our money, consider your job done. Secondly, we're going to be needing good tools. A very sharp one. And all the names of all the people that are threats to you. That's all we need for now. And your job is done. <laughs> I like that. That's not a problem. One more thing, Chief. Do not beg us for a one thing. There's no mercy in this business. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Eyes on the throne. Eyes on the throne. I like it. Eyes on the throne. Oh. Eyes on the throne.
great women of Onui Kingdom. As you all know, this is a policy that was set up by Wana Yeze, one of Onui Kingdom. This is his way of giving back to our society. This is his way of giving back to all the widows in Onui Kingdom. What do you say to one I yes? So if I call your name, you take one thing. Amaki Lo, then your son to take one bag of rice. Hey, if someone like him ascends the throne, it will be a threat to the entire only people. But God will not allow him. Let the fight of the gods be left for the gods to fight. The spirits are watching. This is my elders. My elders, I'm coming from one Ayaz's house. He's sharing rice to all the widows in Oni. What are you saying? Oh no, how have you seen it? Have you seen it? I told you of this man. This man. Good day, Your Majesty. I have a message for you from Wana Yeze. You see, Wana Yeze came up with a policy to touch lives in this community. We give you this gift not because you lack anything. Just to make sure that he touches life of high and low, including the widows in our community, in Onui Kingdom. Please accept them in a good faith. <laughs> All this for me? Yes, yes, Your Majesty. Mm. Thank you, Wana Yeze. Yes, Tell him we accept the gifts in good faith. Yes, yes, yes. And that what he will lack is sickness and death. <laughs> and God will bless him abundantly. <laughs> hey. Your Majesty, I must say your words and prayers are so touchy. I shall convey them to Wana Yeze just exactly the way you prayed it. I shall take my leave now. What do I offer you? No. What will I eat or drink that you have not given to the widows of this great kingdom? The ancestors ask me to greet you. The dead and the spirit are happy for happiness you brought to their wives they left behind. Thank you very much. What an Ayese. He who wants to go fast in life goes alone. He who wants to go far in life goes in company of the ancestors. You have the company of our ancestors, Matana Yeze. I shall take my leave. Thank you very much, Ezemu. Sikiru. Come on, sir. 
get something for us more. My husband will not be happy wherever he is now. Because up till now, the Okalas family has not been able to produce a candidate for the throne. <laughs> oh, Jesse. Uh, my queen. Thank you very much for what you have said. I hear that they are trying to tamper with the selection pattern of our kingship. I have equally heard that uh, you are a beneficiary of the ritual rites which was shared by one years. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, let's see what happens in a couple of months' time from now. That man is not a ritualist. Who is not a ritualist? He is not a ritualist. That's matter. Who is not a ritualist? I said he is not a ritualist. Okay. What is wrong in sharing gifts to people? What is wrong with it? Uh -huh. huh? Look, we in only we are, we are we are just too timid. We are too timid. Huh? In other cities, villages, and towns, people have money share gifts to less privileged ones. Why is our different? Why is it different? Why are we different? Not we. I see. There is nothing wrong with what one years it did, and that should not be what we should be talking about now. What we should be talking about is who will be the next king. I see. <laughs> okay, very well said. No problem. I will sponsor the royal farewell, and I want to be the next king of Onuyi Kingdom, and I will need your support. I will not support you. Eh? Not in a second will I support you. Ezra, what are you not support me? I, I will not support you. Okay. I will not. Look, you have money. What have you done to anybody in this kingdom? Huh? I have money, I have money. Everybody's working in other property. Who will support you? No problem. No problem. I will not support you. Uh, sorry to interrupt you. Uh, I came to hand over the land documents. Stop! Stop there, Edmund! So, the king actually gave you some documents that the queen here does not know anything about. I see. Have you seen it? This young man knows a lot of the late king's investment than any one of us. So tell us, what was the last thing the king told you? Speak! Uh, he, he told me a lot of things. Oh, have you seen it? Have you seen it? The, the, the last time I was in his room, he said something. I want. Majesty. There is a son of this land. I did love to see you. But I don't think it would be possible. <laughs> Oh, you say that. Everything is possible. You are the king of this land. And if the man is the son of the soil, it's possible. I can help you get him if I can. Desmond, my bones are weak. His name is Wana Yeze. Wana Yeze? Yes. I did love to see that young man. so well about Wana Yeze. He regretted not meeting him in person. Oh, I don't really know who he is. I never met him. But of what he said about him, I believe Wana Yeze must be here. Everyone shut up there. Don't keep quiet. There is a popular adage that says keep your friends close and your enemies even closer. So, Edmund, you mentioned that name 
just to spite me, isn't it? And later, they will say, I am hot temper. It's okay. It is well. Your highness. He was the only one moving up and down. They plan to take away the kingship from Okala's family has eaten very deep. And um, it is unfortunate that it is only me, Bruno, that is seeing it. Let us fight for what is ours before it is taken away from us. I repeat, let us collectively fight for what is ours before it is taken away from us. It is well. My queen, don't worry. The truth must always prevail. Oh no. I hear that one Ayese has been sharing bags of rice and um, yam to people so that they can help support him to become king. Bruno, I am the Uno. Is this a discussion or confrontation so that I would know where to start? Oh no, I am not happy the way things are going. Are you aware also that plans are ongoing for our kingship? which is monarchical, to be rotational through a revolution. You have not answered my first question. Is this a discussion or confrontation? If it is the former, let's go inside. But if it is the latter, leave my house. Very well said. I will leave your house. But just know that I will come back for a better discussion. Helper of our community. I have come so that we can talk man to man, so that we can talk man to man and you understand uh, me. You see, tradition is tradition. And uh, we cannot change tradition because uh, uh, someone has money to draw around. No. <laughs> Tradition will not allow it. Are you here to lecture me on our tradition? Oh, yes, I'm here to educate you more because uh, you know you are not always around. And um, I want to remind you that the ancestral stool of Onui, right from the days, of our forefathers has always been occupied by one family, Okala's family. And that cannot begin to change now because of uh, one man who has ambition and who thinks he has money. Oh, yes. You are not making any sense. Huh? You heard me. You are not making any sense. As a matter of fact, you are just blabbing. If you have nothing reasonable to say, I advise you leave. You know why? I am not interested in the throne. Oh yes, you are. I have been making inquiries. I'm aware. I investigated. And um, you have been throwing your weight around with cash. With a view to confuse and convince and truncate the process of our kinship. 
so that it will become rotational and favor you. But that will do no one any good. That will destroy our tradition and culture. You are just a desperate dog. Huh? Yes, every man of play. You are just a desperate dog. And the next time you step into my house, laugh. I will set you up in this As for those dogs out there, pray I don't meet them. Get out. I will leave. No problem. Don't look bright. Are you okay? Um, my love, please, I want you to listen to what I'm about to say carefully. Okay. Since people are beginning to misunderstand your kindness for campaign, I, I would advise you, you better stop. At least for now. Listen. I can't stop being good because of what people will say. I'm bigger than that drama, okay? I'm not a philanthropist because I want people to clap for me, no. It's part of me, I, I, it gives me joy, okay? So I can't stop, I can't change for anyone. Simple. Because in the end, it's all about me. My king, I know all that. I know I am your wife. But do not see you as an obstacle. His desire to stop or silence is seen in his strong hatred for you. I, I advise you to stop, please. Hello. Do I look afraid? No, tell me, do I look afraid? Listen, Bruno is just um a confused old fool, yeah, empty vessel. I know what his problem is. He has complex issues. And he is intimidated with the fact that people always sing my praise. Okay? So forget about Bruno. We are bigger than his drama. Listen. When I say it's okay, it's okay, I'm in charge. Ufadu na zeze, ufadu na yeze Manu nwe lobele mwana ya iyo kuchi yeze Ubele mwana ya In the beginning, there was no more difference between the coward and the courageous person. The only difference is that the coward listened to his fears and follows them. But the courageous person who is the last time and I know you are dead degree. You have never been a coward. <laughs> <laughs> I thank you so much, Akwale. I want to let you know, I will never forget you when I become king. Hmm? For all your information and for everything that you have done to make me succeed, uh, let me tell you, once I become king, I will take you to America. Hey, 
America. Yes. And not only that, all your children I will give scholars. Hey! Thank God for me, your friend. No, it's okay. Thank God for me. You have no idea on what I will do for you. Your entire life I will change for good. Thank God for everything. Uh, and I promise you one thing. I will give you my total support. In fact, you are the best candidate in this community. <laughs> Oh, for the uh, uh, you will be grateful for knowing me. Isabella, son of Okala. It is just a rumor. Even if someone said that, I take it as an opinion. Will, you, more. Fight? will you fight based on someone's opinion? As a man who came with such a dangerous opinion. I know you as a man that uh, sees beyond the physical. Go and sleep with your two eyes closed. Abumbi, besides, why human select? Abumbi, it's not human that you can influence. Onui, it's not like every other kingdom. Bruno, Onui is a kingdom where a king is truly a king. Ezemo, I have heard you. I will have to go now, but I will come back if there are any other issues. Bruno wants to be the leader. Bruno wants to be the king. Wants to be the king of Onyi Kingdom. Ocho riches and Onyi. Anya Bruno di Kwaneze.
good afternoon. Good afternoon. How is everyone? Everyone is fine. Gloria! Look at no. you! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my word! It's been so long! You've changed! You too! You've, you're bigger than I am now! I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> Welcome! Thank you! Oh my god! It's been yeah. forever! Yeah! Who's the boy? Oh, <laughs> this is my son, Colin. I'm actually here to see the How are you, Colin? Carol Lee King is dead. What? He has committed his files. Oh my word! <laughs> is that too late? <laughs> oh God! Oh God! Oh, it's my son. You said your father is no more. Oh. What? <laughs> I don't understand. Yes, my queen. Yes. Whose son? Your father. <laughs> He got me pregnant while I was here. I was too scared to tell anyone except him. I'm sorry. My queen, please forgive me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, my queen. Please forgive me. Please. I didn't mean any of this, but I was just scared. Please. Please forgive me, my queen. Please. Bruno slapped me! Bruno slapped me! I told him I was the person that came up with the, the rotational system. It's just an opinion. He slapped me! I tried to do. Calm down. Calm down. Sit down. Bruno is trying to tear this kingdom apart. Let us see how he succeeds. Just relax. Huh? Okay. I felt I should bring this event to your notice. We've been living in peace and harmony. But Bruno wants to break out the beast in me. He is just a mere boy. Just ignore him. Hmm? Ignore him. Bruno. <coughs> Greetings, the chief priest of our kingdom. Solomon, yes. how are you? I'm fine. Hope all is well. All is well. Our late Tigre son is in the palace. I was asked to come and call you. As a more, of all, I have good news. Tell me, the gods have finally smiled at us. Yes. <laughs> Talk to me. What I'm telling you now is for yes only. For now. Listen, I had an affair with one of my personal mates. My personal cook. Yes. And she became pregnant. Mm -hmm. As I'm talking to you now, mm -hmm. the news reaching me is that she has given birth to a bouncing baby boy. May the gods be! My wife, the queen, knows nothing about this. And you know how she behaves. So for now, let's mellow it down until I put money on her head. So that we can, you know now, you know how to do it. Umpala Fonuyi! Umpala Fonuyi! Hey! Umpala Fonuyi! Umpala Fonuyi! The cause! Yes! He said something like that to me years ago. <laughs> Kingdom. 
Bruno wants to be the king. Manongwe lungwa na yeze. Tell her. Yes, sir. I do not want a regalia that has been seen or worn by anyone. You don't have a problem, sir. I want my coronation to be very, very colorful. Do not spoil it with the choice of material you want to use to sew. Sir, I will give you my best. I promise. I want it um, very, very unique. Is that clear? Yes, sir. Good. Oh, you may go. Yes, sir. Thank you. Oh. Is there any problem? There's a news reaching us now. That the late Igwe son is at the palace. And people are rushing there to see him. I see. <laughs> <laughs> I see. So they are no longer using the reduction plan. Mm. It's okay. I'll go to the palace. I will go to the palace. <laughs> Confess. 
that yes, that she actually seduced the king and that the king got him pregnant, which later produced that child. On our lap, Chaiwe, now listen, she must do it. Let me tell you, the reason why I sent away that, that, that what is that is the Frank, the Union Town President, is because of all this Uruwuru, Uruwuru that is happening. I am not just something. Rubbish. Hmm. I told him that this kingdom is no longer safe for us. But now just look at how they humiliated us today at the market. Hold it. Mama, there is. My son, you're welcome. Why are your faces like this? One are you, sir? I don't know where this dislike is coming from. I know that wealth attracts all manner of jealousy, hatred, dislikes, and all sorts. But not to the extent I see in this kingdom today. Nobody sold to us. People saw us like laborers. Nobody spoke a word to me, Yvonne. After everything we are doing for them, no one spoke a word to me, Yvonne. I am very, very angry. As a matter of fact, I am very, very angry, and that's why I summoned you here. What is it? Good. As a more you see beyond the ordinary, I want you to check my life. Check and tell me if I am a ritualist or not. Or do I do any form of evil to make money? Why will the people of this land be running away at the sight of me? What have I done? Because I'm generous. How do you explain this? People are avoiding me, even my family members. Now, my mom went to the market. Everybody was avoiding her. How do we explain this? How do we explain this? What an amazing. But I consider. This is the handwork of someone who has been paid to do this evil. The scandal of the rich is worse than killing the rich. I advise you calm down. Yes. The land that accepted someone to bless him, that same land can come. 
cause. Let the evil doers continue. You, one of these, will see the end of the wicked. enjoying my money and be calling me evil. No! But on a second thought I said no. I won't. Because I came to realize that the people calling me evil we are paid to do so. But as for Bruno he will meet his waterloo because you can't wrestle an honor. Are you aware of the king's son that is in the palace now? What? The king's son. How? From where? The king got one of his cooks pregnant. Didn't tell anybody about it because he did not want his wife to know. Now that boy Collins is in the palace. And Bruno is saying that Carol, his mother, must wear. Huh? All right then. Yeah. In that case, we have to proceed with the arrangement. I will pay. Mwana yeze, ikeze bobe, obele mwana ye.
What's your name again? Nelson. Yes, Nelson. Uh, how are you? I'm fine. I'm fine. Sir. And uh, what do you do for a living? Um, actually, sir, I'm into surgical equipment. Surgical equipment? And what is the meaning of that? Okay, so I'm, I'm into hospital equipment. I supply wheelchairs, beds, oh, everything oh. about hospital. And how are you managing in this harsh economic situation that we find ourselves? <laughs> So actually, that has been the major problem. But anyway, I'm managing. Uh, uh, listen to me. What, what's that your name? Nelson. Dan. Nelson, that's right. Any man that will marry my own sister, daughter of the late Igwe of Onuyi, should not have any problem and should not use that word managing. Is that clear? Yes, sir. Anyway, I want you to come to my house later and I will give you. 10 million naira huh? to put in your business. Oh, really? yeah, Meanwhile, let me go and see how far they have gone uh, with the goat sticking. Ah, thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, oh, my God. I need to sit down. <laughs> you know what we can do with that? Oh, my God. Then we can start planning our wedding properly. Oh, I have a long list. I have things I need to buy. Ah, oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. 10 million there. 10 million. Oh. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. <laughs> Only you. <laughs> I'm so happy. Wait. You are safe, my brother. Um, Come, let me tell you. Come, don't worry. Nobody's here. It is uh, important that I, I correct the mistakes that I made before due to my anger and hot temper. What mistake are you talking about here now? What is the mistake? What are you saying? Do you know, I have realized that uh, one man cannot make it alone. And um, I have realized that um, the more we all have it, in our community, the better for us. I have promised that every man and woman uh, in this kingdom must must be wealthy. Uh, not just man and woman, but every young man, every young girl and boy, and those who are youth at heart, especially the Okalas family. But uh, we must be economically independent. I thank God for making you to realize this, that your class need to be well united and well coordinated. I have also realized that um, it was because of my anger that the late Igwe uh, could not help me. Oh, uh, but, but that's okay. That's all gone now. We must move forward. Okay. And, um, I will want you uh, to tell me how much it will cost you to build your own school in this Onuiyi town. Huh? Uh, let me know. <laughs> my own school. school I mean, I, it's like I didn't hear you well. Oh, I will work under you. No, you can't work under me. Yours to become oh, your own My property. own school. <laughs> your own school. Hey. How much it will cost. And then you come, I'll give you the money to do it. Uh, Bruno, <laughs> I am confused. I don't know what to say. It's okay. My old school. Your you school. give me one to build it. I also want Hi. you to um, tell Orebunam 
to tell me how much it will cost. Uh, I will give him the money as well to build his own fish pond business. Hey, you are great. Uh, the more we are, the merrier. I thank Everybody God. must. I am uh, confused. I am confused. I don't know what to say. All of us in the family. Mm. Hey, God that bless you. That is great. Don't I, I, I don't. Hey. 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 Ten million naira, mama. So he now he can add to his business. <laughs> I'm so happy. <laughs> I hope it's good. Ten million. Ten million naira is not a small. <laughs> Mother, you see why I don't tell you things. Eh? You always find something negative to put inside everything you talk about. Eh? Uncle Bruno was just not happy that the elders did not take care of him when he was younger. They abandoned him, but he has forgiven them now. That's all. Uh, uh, my husband. Uh, uh, Welcome, Uncle. Old, uh, my princess. Uh, well, uh, <clears throat> everything went perfectly well. Look, <laughs> my happiness is about the unity that won't engulf the whole of this family. <laughs> oh. uh, what do you mean, unity? What unity? No, no. Bruno has given us hope again. He sent him to tell me that I should check how much I will use to revive my fish pond business. Ah! Oh, ka, ka na po, bawi. He also asked me. To look for what it cost me to build my own school. <laughs> my own school is a water school. <laughs> yes. Yes. Hey. Uh, he has added life to your lives. Mm -hmm. I'm also happy. And I will thank him when I see him. Please do. So. <laughs> Please do. I'm so happy. I think Uncle Bruno is a changed man now. Of course. I'm really happy. <laughs> In fact, I had the news today at the palace and I said that so I should come and see you. Those who are condemning your name are the people who do not want the progress of the town. Listen, I have come to realize that no matter what you do in life, people will always talk with your back. Yes. But that doesn't stop me from being good. In the end, it's all about me. And what they are saying is not affecting my account balance. And don't forget, my biters are always the back. Since they have decided to take my meekness for weakness, my good for evil, my kind gesture, it's bad. It's all good. They say that you go about in the community helping the masses because you want to be a king. Whoever gave that impression must be very, very stupid and jobless at the same time. Listen, I'm a philanthropist because I believe givers never lack. It gives me joy to give. I'm not doing it for people to clap for me or to be glorified. No, it's in me, it's part of my life. And trust me, I can't change for no man. So if they are thinking of coming for the troll, no, I am not interested in the troll. The troll will literally engage to me and will affect my business. So I'm not interested in it. But being good, I won't stop being good because of what people are saying. Uh, Glory. Yes, sir. I must say, I am happy to see you. And uh, by his grace, things are getting better. Things are better. And so, uh, this is a drink for you. And over there, too, on my shelf, uh, choose whatever you want. <laughs> Uncle Bruno, food and drinks are not what we came here for. Actually, Nelson and I, we came to say thank you so much for everything you've done for us. The money, everything. We're so grateful. Thank you so much, Uncle. 
You don't have to mention it. I have said it. I do not want the enemy of our family to succeed. Sure. Oh yes. And I only have promised that every son of Okala's family must be economically dependent. Oh yes. I will send colleagues to abroad, I mean America, to go there, study, and come back with more knowledge. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you so much. That is amazing. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Chief. Yes. Collins was happy. He said after he goes into our room, he will come and see you. Did you hear that? You see? So Collins is going to go. And nobody has told me. And I'm just telling this for the first time. I want to be able to know that you have somebody here. It's all good. Don't be like this. I had no idea. I did not know, Bruno. This will never, ever happen again. Not while I'm around. It will never happen again. I'm so sorry. Please. Please. That's okay. Please. That's okay. How is my wife? <laughs> oh, well. Oh, well. They are better than me. <laughs> uh, they will be coming back here to stay with me for some time. Uh, before going back. You can't. You need to meet the wife. She's very beautiful. She cooks <laughs> really well to our wife. It's something else. Really nice. Ah, that's okay. Uh, that's okay. Thank they you. They are busy Bruno. chopping my money. Ah, <laughs> you have the money now. They have to eat it. <laughs> ah, that's okay. Yes, sir. Nelson, are you sure you don't want to have anything to drink? No, you're fine, Chief. Are you sure? You? <laughs> ah, that's okay. <laughs> you have done so far. Okay? Um, this is for you. And um, this is equally for you. And um, I want to assure you, this is outside whatever we have bargained for. Is that clear? Enjoy yourself. Boss! You are the boss of all bosses. Point of correction. It's where I am. That's it. Don't point. Your Highness, might give one for you now. <laughs> Boss, our eyes are on the eyes of the people looking at you. <laughs> on how they cross your path, you crush them. <laughs> <laughs> Boss! That is very good. That is very good. Uh, let me quickly add here that um, this is just the beginning. And uh, the more you do better jobs, I'll give you something to cheer for. You'll have more money. More and more. Huh? Hey, we'll Your Highness. Yes. You are here. Nothing will stop you. Thank you. Anything that will stop you, eh? <laughs> Since Igwe joined his ancestors, we have not come to visit him. Right. Oh, Jesus. You know, any time I enter this palace, my mood changes. You know, Igwe was my good friend. And you know, he had no male child. This put me off. Thank God he has a male child that will succeed him. Mm -hmm. 
I was so happy the day Collins came. Oh, since Collins is here, that means Igwe is not dead. Because any man with a male child is not yet dead. Yeah. <laughs> Your Highness, Collins has been kidnapped. What? How did it happen? Oh my God! Where? No. Hey. Is the son of Okala. Ezemo, we were attacked on our way to Akumpu Shrine. The attackers kidnapped Collins.
Anyway. I want you to use it uh, for the building. And uh, when it's not, it's uh, finished, you can come back. I will give you more. I think the reason for the kidnap is to disorganize our family, the Okalas, so that the kinship can move to other family. What has this family done before the arrival of Collins? You people have never been in order. No, no, you are absolutely right. We've never been in order. But let me tell you something. Instead of us losing the cow, let us cut off the deal. Our brother, Bruno Kala, Anana Buibana Baini, Ozo Bunisi, Onatwa Keba Gelia, Udua Komini One. He has the connection, he has the money, he has everything. I think he should be the next in hmm. Hey, our kingship has been peaceful. Only he has never experienced power tosses before. Money and greed has torn apart a town that was once peaceful. Uh, our land has become a land of fear. Uh, According to the Alpha, the whole thing points at one Nayoese who has been doing well for us. Arthur can never be threat. It could be another person. Hey. Who could that be? Udeque, don't get it twisted. I know who the Arthur is talking about. Oh. If you don't know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's the more is here now. There's the more of the Ono and the elders. The gods has instructed that we'll have a meeting with our Kala's family. I do not know the agenda, but a message will come from them. Aha! Aha! Thank the gods that Ezemo, Ono, and two of our elders are here. How lucky we are! Uh, <laughs> what message do you have for us, Orebunam, son of Ikogo, Okala? Have you seen Collins? Ezemo, we the Okalas 
have decided that Bruno Chukwujeku Okala will be our candidate for the throne. <laughs> If that is the conclusion of the family, uh, then let's prepare him for confirmation. <laughs> Do not be too clever for your own good, Oribunam. Huh? Have you informed Bruno about his candidacy? Not yet. But the decision of the family can never be rejected. I will tell him now. That is okay. Mm -hmm. Relate to me soon as you conclude arrangement with Bruno. I will take my leave. Mm. Okay. There's too much evil in the land. Eyes on the throne. Eyes on the throne.
for himself. said 
Wana Yeze, that I know, cannot be the person that kidnapped that boy. Oh, no. Ah. Anyway, your colors have picked their chosen one. Huh? Then uh, who is the chosen one? Bruno Okala has been chosen as the next Okala by the Okala. Ha! Ha! Bruno! Bruno! Hi! Oh no, this is the first one. Not minding that someone is missing already. Hi! Oh no, what are we doing? What are we doing? Do not be too clever, Frank, for your own good. The ways of the gods are not our ways. In human sense, you may be right. But right and wrong belongs to the gods. They are the judge. Hmm. Oh no, Bruno. Bruno. Ha! Everybody. Bano, Bano. Kukujeku, Bruno, Okala, today is a day set aside for your confirmation as the new Upala of Onuyi. The offer of Onuyi is there. Go, take it, and become the new Upala of Onuyi. Kujeku, Bruno, Okala, Akbumpi rejects you. As you know, Mpala upon you. Akachi, sir. Update my elders. My name is Agachi. I'm the security officer in charge of the community hospital. I was on a regular check around the hospital when I saw something. I quickly picked up my phone and record. Here is what I recorded. Bruno, this car of some wicked? As a man, I need us to take this young boy to our own bay for confirmation. Not today. Not this night. For nothing can be done except tomorrow. Police! 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 
Police is back. Queen Mother, Princess! Princess! Police is back. Police is back. Police is back. Princess! Police, my son! He's back. Police! My son! Giving money to people. It's a plot to destroy everyone. Hey! Eh? Because I want. Oh. I'm talking to you now. You know, this is police custody. They are killing his two guys. Oh, he's already in police custody. That is what he deserves. Enough is enough. This is too much. God be punishing for me. My yes. God be punishing. God be My God be punishing. Punish you know. I knew he was okay. a good man. I knew something was wrong. Thank you. Oh God, thank you. <laughs> No, of only your kingdom. What I'm about telling you now, I told Oribunam earlier when he came here to confess that Bruno, Chukujeku, Okala gave them money to influence his candidacy. The era of one family ruling only is over. Abunti says confirmation is now open for someone with clean hands. of my coming here will not permit me to take anything. Thank you. Please sit, madam. I offer you? Uh, like I told your mother, the urgency of my being here will not permit me to take anything. <laughs> I have come to tell you that Abumpi has declared that the era of one family bringing who will be king is over. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> Wait for the best one. Our umpi also declared that no one is qualified in our Kala's family. Wow. Anazeza zo. Mba. Anazeza zo. Mba. Anazeza zo. Olu. Mba. Anazeza zo. Mba. I told Bruno, you can't wrestle an oracle. You can't wrestle an oracle. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> it's only our own that we own our side. Remember me? I was once a palace servant. I'm here to see you. Oh, oh, Sita, it's been long. In this community these days, one should be careful. What can I do for you? I am looking for my son, Collins. Carol brought him to the palace, thinking that he is his great son. And I heard he was kidnapped. Oh no, please help me. Collins, your son? Yes, I'm very sure of that. He's been found. Oh. He's now at the palace. <laughs> Thank you, Lou. Thank you. Oh, I see. I now know that was why he was not the chosen one. He is not the chosen one. I knew it! I knew this would happen! I think with the situation of things now, eh, maybe Nelson can try it out. Who knows? Maybe Akunko will choose him. Princess, do not bother. The 10 million he collected from him has disqualified him. I just hope you people will learn from this. So it will repeat itself. That gift was a greedy one. Bruno has ever been a good man. It's like you don't understand what I'm saying. I said he is into rituals. Yes. I confirmed that myself. Everybody in the kingdom, even in the market, people are running away from us. Please, please, don't give me this advice. Please. I can't stay now. I'm scared. Please, I can't, I, I can't. I have been trying. I, I can't cope with the ritualists. I can't. I've been trying. Please, just keep your advice. Okay. I will see you very soon. Just take care. Wana Yezi. Today is a day set aside for your confirmation as the new Mpala of Oni. The offer of only you is there. Go. Take it and become the new Mpala. Ha <laughs> ha 
Very sorry that I abandoned you. Please, I was just a male servant that didn't have money. I would have taken you along. I would have loved to take you along, but I don't have money. That was why. Your sister has refused to come. This until you say you have forgiven me. I am your father. I'm I'm so not sorry. My father. The late king is my father. I'm forgiving you. You may go in peace. Thank you. 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 Thank you very much. Thank you. Go, go, go. Thank you. How are you? Go. Thank you, son. But the 10 million he gave us was for a good cause. It was to support us. Yes, it was. But that also denied you your birthright forever. Hey, Ori has gotten a, a new king. Hmm? One of years is a new king. Huh? Apple has chosen him. Huh? Yes. Huh? Yes. Heartwarming news for you. Your son, Chief Ike Ezebi, Matana Yeze, or now Boy Shakiti Bobo, Shakiti Bobo, has been chosen by the great Apompe to ascend the throne of Onui Kingdom. <laughs> hmm. What did you just say? You heard me clearly. Apompe has chosen your son. To ascend as the Mbala the second of Oni Kingdom. <laughs> Since I know you, this is the best, the most sensible thing you have said with your mouth. Thank you for this news. <laughs> yeah, now prudent is going to be the law of Mana Yez. One of only kingdom. Oh no, but shakiti bobo, shakiti bobo. I'm prudent to be dancing. Shaku, 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 shaku. <laughs> Simple. Yes, your real majesty. Prudent is out of the picture. She's no longer there. She left. She called my son in choice. My uncle? I overheard her talking with somebody on the phone. And when she discovered that I heard her, out of shame she left because she couldn't face me. How could she do a thing like that? Your Real Majesty, I think we have a problem now. Because according to the tradition of Onu Ikenda, Wana Yeza is supposed to have a wife before he will be crowned the next Mbala of Onei Kingdom. Okay. Um, 
And that's your worry? Yes. Relax. I held a meeting with the thing. The old thing. Okay. I said, my son has been chosen. So she's going to be the first. Right now. Held a meeting with her. But the basic thing is that my son likes Princess Gloria. So some of the elders will protect her the rights. My son is taking her daughter as a wife. Princess Gloria. So it's a match of the royals coming together. Uh, are you real, Majesty? Oh, perhaps my ear is disturbing. Are you saying Juana Yensen is going to get married to Princess Gloria? Exactly. <laughs> ah. This is another good news. Ah, but that is not nice. Oh, all these things going behind my simple did not know about it. Ah, you really you know now. I told you. Ah, this is a good news. Anyway, it's a good news. Uh, but but uh, what about um, Nelson, her fiance? That one. And I'm away. He went to America with Bruno Stemmingen. Like run away? Yes. <laughs> I can see everything turning around, turning around, turning around for one I yes. <laughs> one Your Royal Majesty now you will be addressed as her Royal Majesty the Queen. <laughs> Queen Mother of Only Kingdom. <laughs> the mother of what Anna yes, or now what Shakiti Bobo, Shakiti Bobo, and perhaps the great will be dancing Shako Shako. <laughs> you really are just my buffer is salty. He's getting salty. Let's take your face. Let's take your face. You really are my sister. You Thank you. 
As you all know, Akumpi chose Watana Yeze to be the king of Onui Kingdom. Today is that day. I have the honor to call on Onu 
of Oluyi Kingdom to come and perform his duties. Vested in me as the owner of only kingdom, I hereby call on Martin Ayesi to come and take what belongs to him. Please put your hands together.
Greatest philanthropist of our time. What are you going to do? Oh, no, I'm going to shake it up. Shake it up. No, I'm going to shake it up. Shake it up. Shake it up. Do you know what you're doing? Great people of only in kingdom. I have a very beautiful song that I would like to do for. What are you going to do? One of only. Please come with me. Simple, you have proven to me beyond all reasonable doubt that you are tested and trusted. Honor you by the powers vested on me as the king. I pronounce simple as the Akes. Okay, the one of honor Please. Go and sing for me. You are my first time. I'm going to miss you.